In the world of interior paint colors, it's all about guidelines, technique, and experience. But every once in a while, rules are meant to be broken as long as you know what you're doing. And last month was a classic example. I was helping a client build a gray color palette with cream colors. And one of the cream colors I was helping with is right here today. It's called Gentle Cream. I'm gonna show you what makes this cream color so unique. And I'm gonna give you three valuable tips that you need to know about this paint color before deciding to paint it in your home. I'm gonna show you what makes Gentle Cream so unique. It's not a light cream paint color. It's not yellow like a lot of cream paint colors out there. And there's an undertone underneath this paint color that you need to know about. So watch this. When I compare this with Age White by Sherwin Williams, it's considered a cream paint color. Watch what happens. Gentle Cream is gonna look darker and heavier than Aged White. Now, watch what happens when I compare with the true yellow paint color called Western Flax by Benjamin Moore. You're gonna notice that Gentle Cream doesn't have the yellow undertone that you see in a lot of cream paint colors. Now, watch what happens when I compare it with Delaware Putty. This is called the Yellow Beige by Benjamin Moore. You'll notice when I compare this with Gentle Cream that there's just a slight orange undertone. This is so important to know for a lot of reasons, but to keep it simple, this undertone is what makes this paint color from looking too yellow, and it's what makes this cream look a little bit darker than a lot of cream paint colors out there. Now, I'm not saying that when you paint this on your wall that you're gonna see an orange undertone. It's far from it. All right, so what makes this so unique? is that it's a darker cream paint color. It doesn't look yellow like a lot of cream paint colors and it's very versatile with both interior and fixed elements that you may have in your home as long as you know how to pair it right. Otherwise, you could end up making a costly mistake and I don't want that to happen to you. For those of you that are new to this channel, feel free to subscribe. I give you valuable information just like you're seeing right here in this video. Next, I'm gonna give you three valuable tips that you need to know. Tip number one, for those of you that have a lot of Tuscan elements in your kitchen and you're thinking about painting your kitchen cabinets, then you might wanna consider painting it with Gentle Cream. Gentle Cream goes really well with a lot of Tuscan elements, but I would highly recommend that you pair it with the fixed elements that you have in your kitchen because the last thing I wanna happen is for you to make a costly mistake. Tip number two, for those of you that are thinking about painting Gentle Cream as your wall color for your home, then it's important to pair it with the right trim color. And I wanna show you a really good trim color that works well. It's called Dover White by Benjamin Moore. And as you can see, when I compare these two paint colors, you'll notice that there's a nice contrast and both of these will work beautifully together. And tip number three, there is no such thing as a cream color that doesn't have any yellow. You can't make a cream without a yellow and a white to keep it simple. So for those of you that are looking for a cream and you don't want any yellow, then I would recommend staying away, far away from creams. Is there a cream paint color that you would like me to talk about in a future color review video? Let me know in the comment section down below. I would love to hear your comments. And for those of you that are looking to prevent from making a costly mistake and you want to get it right the first time, then feel free to check out the link in the description section that's right below this video. It's going to take you to my website. I'm going to show you how I can help you regardless where you live in North America. And feel free to check out the reviews. I would love to help you. Until then, I will see you in the next video.